Here at Kift, everyone has some sort of vehicle that they can sleep in. Predominantly vans, but you're welcome to bring a truck camper, a Prius if you've gotten the bed and back. Basically, we all sleep in our vans. We then park our vans around our properties, and then we have access to the houses where we cook, we hang out, we have showers, we have all, you know, all the amenities that you're used to having in a house. And then otherwise, you've got a property full of vans. Everyone can sleep in there. You've got your own space when you need your own space. Otherwise, you can come hang out inside where everyone's chilling and hanging out. Welcome to the living room. We've got some co-working space in the middle here. We've got the nice hot fire going. And Maria is cooking up some amazing tacos over here in the kitchen. We've got food here for 25. We've got our big industrial kitchen. And out here we've got big fridge. We got food for days out here. <laughs> and yeah, we've just got some co-working space in the bedrooms. And yeah, that is the, the gist of the gift house. Welcome. Come check out the Kif trailer. In this box here, we've got a full Renogy electrical system that will power our entire trailer of 25 Nomads for three months down in Baja. We've got 600 amp hours of lithium. We've got the Renogy 3000 watt AC charger and uh, inverter. We've got the 60 amp MPPT and that all leads to an entire solar system and laptop, fridge, everything that we need to be off-grid. So while we are traveling, this space here is going to double as both the kitchen area um, in the morning, and then it'll swap over into co-working space. We're a group of nomads, so it's really important that we be able to remote work while we're down in Baja. We've got Starlink on the roof uh, that provides the Wi-Fi. We are still in the middle of finishing this build, so it is still a bit of a rough, uh, work in progress, but you can get the general gist of everything that we got going on here. We're gonna have three co-working spaces in here so folks can come in, get out of the sun after they're done surfing in the morning and be able to do some work uh, while we're on the beach. So we're a community of about 100 people that live together full time on the road. This is our community chalkboard. So we're gonna have who's cooking dinners, what night, uh, where we're going, what dogs we got, what allergies, what food allergies we have, so that we make sure that it's front and center for the whole community. And this is where we're gonna keep all of our information organized while we travel in Baja. We've got two 200 watt solar suitcases for 400 watts total. Those plug into the back of the trailer. And then up top here, we've got 400 watts of solid mounted solar panels. They're all Renogy. And that is the solar system and how it keeps it all charged. Hi, my name is Zoya Johnson, and I've been with Kift since April with my amazing partner. Hi, my name is Matai Blacklock, and this is our cute little puppy, Noor. Noor just joined us a few days ago, but <laughs> as Zoya said, we've been with Kift since April. We started out in one of the Kift vans, and now we've got our own little tiny home trailer that we tow around with our SUV. There are a bunch of exciting announcements um, coming up on the Kift front. One, we're super grateful to have pa partnered with Renogy to be able to build out our solar trailer um, that we're taking down to Baja. So we're launching our first member-led caravan where members are getting together and planning a 10-week trip down to the southern tip of Baja and back. Um, and beyond that, when we come back, we'll be looking to expand our list of locations. So hopefully with the location in Colorado opening up soon. Um, and in addition, we're actually in some talks with some companies to try and offer tiny home setups that would be um, installed on site. So members wouldn't need to have vehicles to use as their bedroom. They would also have the option to use tiny homes. My name's Santi Katuri. I've been with Kif for about a year and a half. I help run the technology here and was one of the I don't know, visionaries or leaders and builders of this amazing project that we're super excited to partner with Renogy for. Uh, and my name is Dustin Grevenberg. I'm a KIF community member. I've been with KIF for about a year now and yeah, really excited to push forward with this radical experiment that we're creating. Cool.
We did a lot of, uh, we had the Renergy products, so we built it around, designed and built the space, designed and built the system around the products, the components we had. And we're building a system that's going to support a lot of people, fully off-grid, uh, running a Starlink every day. So we wanted to make sure we had the power for that. So we put two 200 watt solar panels on the roof and an additional two 200 watt solar suitcases. So we have 800 watts total. Yeah, we've got three fridges and a freezer um, and we have enough power for that. We've got some co-working stations. We've got some monitors for your laptop as well. We can power those all throughout the day. And yeah, the system worked out great. We've got 600 amp hours of lithium power, um, that's going to be more than enough um, to keep everything fully charged. Even if it's a gray day like today, we still get enough, uh, still got enough juice in there to power everything throughout the day. Installation was super easy. The documentation was great. Um, we used some nice 4 watt cable to connect the batteries and some beautiful 12 and 10 gauge wire up to the AC inverter and um, if we ever need to, we can pull the, the camper up into an RV park to charge. We can also charge it off of one of our vans. Um, a lot of our vehicles have the Renogy 3000 watt inverter, so we can actually run one of our vehicles and charge the trailer off of the 3000 watt inverter uh, in one of our rigs. And the ease of installation gave us some time and room to play around and give it a nice, nice display, set it up in a way that it really looks nice and really displays the product really well. Yeah, I think um, the, the broader vision is really to look at how um, people are living together and really try and innovate in new ways. With, with modern technology like Starlink, the, the accessibility of solar energy, we're able to post up wherever we want in the world and start communities. We at KIF started with van life first because it was easy to transition and find places of land with some basic amenities on them. And then um, we were able to quickly grow to a large number of community members sharing access to those resources. So really the core tenets of KIF are all about uh, communal, sharing communal spaces uh, and creating amazing community experiences. Yeah. It's going to be really cool to see that um, blossom from van life essentially into something we call geo-distributed cities. So we won't need a, a central space to be able to continue the culture. It, it will essentially uh, be able to cultivate itself because of how organically we've built this thing up. The best way to get involved is to come on site and find out what we're all about. We host welcome weekends at least once a month, and we're always hosting a bunch of fun pop-up events, normally festivals around every solstice. So jump on our Discord, which is our kind of like chat community hub, where you're able to see all of our events and announcements. Visit our website, sign up for our mailing list, and come on site and come hang out with us. You can start online, but the real magic happens in person. Looking forward to seeing you.